What's up, Japanese baseball bettors? This is Caesar with Japanese Baseball TV, and we have one very juicy bet today in the MPB, Japanese Baseball League. Uh, today is October 30th. It's Friday. Uh, the games will be held at 6 o'clock p.m. in Japan, which is 2 a.m. Friday morning in the U.S. Arizona time. Uh, we hit a bad skid yesterday. Uh, I was winning two of my games until the ninth inning, and they just flipped around in the very last inning. So we're on a little bit of bad luck. Uh, however, our record is still 103 and 85, I think. Uh, the official record I'm putting below, so please check below. Um, there's one really good bet today, so we're taking it. And I'll show you in just a moment. But before we do that, uh, today's jersey is... Uh, Kanuma Higashi High School from Tochigi. This is the pat, uh, the Tochigi, the prefecture name over here. Here's the patch on the other side, and uh, Ka Numa Higashi. Ka means deer, actually, and uh, Numa is a, a, a swamp. So it's a deer swamp east high school. If you translated it. Uh, directly. Anyways, it's kind of a nice jersey. I always like the ones with Japanese writing. It does have the prefecture name over here, and it's got the patch over here, so it's kind of cool. Um, this is actually a Osaka. This O stands for O. This is actually a Hanshin Tigers uh, hat, uh, but it kind of matched, so I just put them together. In any case, let's get to the games today. Um, the Yakult Swallows are going to the Tokyo Dome. They're coming to the big city to play the Giants. Uh, we got Imamura going against Sai Uchi. Um, let's see, neither pitcher's really uh, doing well, but Sai Uchi's doing really poorly this year. Um, his year uh, whip is 189, and I have his... But I have that exactly the same as his, because Sayuchi didn't play in the last three years. He came back from the dead from like four or five years ago, and he started playing. So these are his numbers just for this year. He's got 5Ks per nine, and he's walking 2.8 per nine. Uh, Imamura walks more than that, but he strikes out more, and his whip is a little bit better. So we've got a team with a better starting pitcher, a better bullpen, and a better lineup. But the Giants have lost five games in a row. Uh, they're in a bit of a funk. You can see their lineup is sleeping. Uh, but the Swallows lineup is sleeping even more. So I give the Giants a 67% chance to win this game, which projects to 1.47 or minus 211 odds. The bookmaker's only giving 1.33. Uh, I'm not going to bet this game mainly because... Uh, Imamura's numbers against Yakult. He's started twice and he's got an 11 5 7 ERA. I would be tempted to take a three way money line with the Giants, but until I saw that number, but after I saw that number, no way. So I'm not touching this game. Let's move on. Uh, the next game we have the Hanshin Tigers leaving Koshien to go play the Bay Stars in Yokohama. We got Kyoyama against Gunkel. We got two. Pitchers who are performing very badly this year, and they're performing badly against each uh, each other's team as well. Um, my the bookie's giving it ten runs. My projection says eight point three. Uh, I am not betting an under on this because both teams are hitting hot right now, and both starting pitchers are pretty bad. My numbers say bet under ten. Uh, so if you want to take a flyer on that, go ahead. But I am staying away from this game. Move on to the next, which is our juicy matchup of the day. We do have a bet on this. The Hiroshima Carp are going to Nagoya Dome to play the Chunichi Dragons. Nagoya is where I used to live. Uh, great city, wonderful place. Uh, Rodriguez for the Dragons going against Tokoda for the Carp. Uh, I project this as a 9.07 runs. Uh, even my pitcher first five inning projections projected to nine say this is going to go over nine runs. The bookie has it at six. Jump on that. Grab it right now because that six is not going to be there forever. Uh, it's going to go up to six, five, seven, seven, five. If you can grab a six on this game, grab it now. I already grabbed it. Uh, I bet 5% uh, of my bankroll on this. Uh, this is... Uh, 
a very juicy play. Um, I have the Dragons as a 59% chance of winning the game, but I'm not betting the side because uh, I projected it 168. Bookie's offering 180, so there's no uh, no value there. But there's huge value on the over six. If it loses, hey, I'm sorry, but all we can do is place good bets, go on the probability, and place good bets. No, none of us can see the future, but when you see huge value like this, uh, it's a five percent play for me. Uh, so that's our bet today is over six in the Chunichi Hiroshima game. Uh, and also the Dragons are hitting pretty hot. The Dragons are fighting to keep second place uh, going into the playoffs. Uh, the car pretty much out of it and they're cold at the plate right now. Um, Tokoda and uh, Rodriguez numbers against each other are not very good either. As you can see uh, Rodriguez against the Carp is 506 in one start. Tokoda in three starts against the Dragons is 514. So this is definitely a bet on situation. I don't have any other bets, but I will show you my numbers. Uh, the Buffaloes uh, are going to take on the Fighters at Sapporo Dome. Uh, my numbers say 52% chance Buffaloes win. Uh, my over under is 8.5. The bookie's offering 7. So there is a little value on the over 7, but both teams are hitting pretty cold. Uh, the last few days, uh, these two teams have been in one nothing, two nothing games, so I'm not betting it. My numbers also say that Oryx uh, over three and a half runs for a team total is a good bet. I'm not betting it, but if you want to, uh, I would not argue against it. Next game, we have the SoftBank Hawks going to the MetLife Dome in Saitama to take on the Lions of Cebu. Um, my numbers give a 53% chance to the Hawks. Hawks are starting Higashihama, who is their opening day starter. Uh, I wouldn't say he's an ace level pitcher, but he is consistent. Uh, you can see his numbers here. He's got a 112 whip with a 218 ERA, so he's performing above uh, what his three year numbers are. Uh, he does strike out 7.9 per inning, per nine innings, but he does walk quite a few, 366. Hidai is going for the uh, Lions. He's actually, as you can see, he averages only 1.26 innings in appearance. Uh, he's actually a reliever, so they're going to do an opener type thing today. And the Lions, with their bullpen, uh, they have the fourth best bullpen in Japan, uh, whereas the uh, Hawks have the first uh, ranked bullpen in Japan. Um, I'm not going to bet this game. But I do think the Hawks have an advantage here. They've got the better starting pitcher, the better bullpen, and the lineups are pretty equal. Um, also, the Hawks are hot hitting at the plate right now. The Lions are cold. So uh, my numbers say there's value on the Lions because I put the, the mark at uh, plus 113, which is 2.13. The bookies are giving 2.6. So there is value if you want to take a live dog here. I'm not going to do it, though. Uh, but if you like to, if you're jonesing to make bets uh, and feeling frisky, uh, you certainly can put a couple shekels on that. Uh, my members say there is value there. Uh, one last game. Uh, the Rakuten Eagles are taking on the Lotte Marines in Chiba at the Zozo Marine Stadium. Uh, I project eight runs here. The bookie has it at seven. So there is slight value on the over seven. Uh, I have these teams very evenly matched. The bookie gives a huge advantage to the Eagles. Um, I'm not going to bet that. The Eagles are hot. Let's erase that. That was yesterday's bet. Uh, the Eagles are hot at the plate right now. Uh, the Marines are ice cold, but they did pull out the win yesterday, uh, which lost my bet. <laughs> uh, or no, I'm sorry. The, the, they didn't. They were winning uh, until the last inning, and their bullpen blew it. Uh, but they did score three runs yesterday. Um, the Eagles are hot at the plate. Uh, I'm going to stay away from this game. There's too many conflicting numbers, uh, so I'm going to stay away from it. So those are my numbers. Uh, if you're feeling frisky and you're Jones in the bet, I would bet the over in this game. Uh, I would also bet the... Well, I would not bet the Lions in this game, but my numbers say there is value on the Sabre Lions as a live dog. I'm not going to do that. Uh, my numbers say that the Oryx Buffaloes team total over three and a half is a good bet. Also, the over seven in this game is a good bet. I'm not betting it though. 
And this is the juicy bet of the day, which is a, an official play. We're taking the Dragons and Carp to go over six runs. I have no idea why this is six runs. Uh, both pitchers have uh, bad ERAs and bad whips. Uh, one of the teams is hitting hot. One of the teams is fighting tooth and nail for their playoff position, which is Chunichi. Um, so over six is the bet today with confidence. Look, any bet can lose. But I'm just saying that has huge value, so I'm on it. Um, Tigers base stars, uh, under 10 is a value bet. I'm not betting it. And the last game, Swallows Giants, no bet there. So please support me. Like and subscribe below. I will be back with more content. Uh, Kanuma Higashi is the baseball jersey today. Um, so that's our bet today. Uh, happy Friday. Have a good weekend. I'll be back with more videos uh, and uh, hope we can keep building our record. Uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. I do appreciate it. Please like and subscribe and I'll be back with more. Thanks.